All right, the Seahawks are now on the clock. The pick has come in by the Chicago Bears. So let's see what the pick is in here. I'm getting back to get nervous now again. Oh, my God. I thought I got through the nervous uh, maze here, but I'm back into it. <laughs> oh, dude. Willis is tweeting. No, don't tweet, Willis. Put your phone down. Put your goddamn phone down, Malik. Okay, Abraham Lucas, Travis Jones. Oh, my God, the amount of great players available to us right now at the moment. Dear God, here we go. Don't go quarterback. Don't go quarterback. You don't need to do it. You don't need to do it here, guys. The amount of players that have drift, drift down to us here, the way that this draft has unfolded for you, John, you haven't had to trade back. You haven't had to make all this movement. You haven't had to work really hard to do it. You just had to sit back and let them land in your lap. They have landed now in your lap. This pick has landed here right in your lap. Don't overthink it. You haven't overthought one part of this draft so far. Don't start now. Don't start now. Don't start now. Quarter, quarter, I'm not going to hate if you go quarterback, but don't start now. There's Lucas in the third? Lucas in the third? Travis Jones in the third? These are difference makers at the position. Maybe not stars, but a, a, a way above average as far as their potential goes. Pull that trigger. Pull that trigger. Run to that podium. That's right, Flag Sabbath. Run to that podium, damn it. Pick is in. Pick is in. We don't have to think about it. Come on. If it's between Lucas, Philele, and Jones, I am going to be so effing happy. I'm going to be so effing happy if it's one of those three. Oh, if it's one of those three, if they can just do that. If they can do it. it that's just too, almost too good to be true a draft. Just too good to be a true. To get to, to pull out that hall on the four. That's what I was saying. With, I was telling you guys what I was going to do with this draft. This tier, this tier this year. This tier two is too killer. It's too killer. It's too good. It ain't like other years. It ain't like other, it ain't like other boys and girls, this draft. Oh, Johnny. Johnny, they slept on you this year, man. They slept on you and they let this pick drop to you. <sighs> they let this pick drop to you and then you just, just... Don't you overthink this, man, okay? Do what you did. Stay in, this, stay in the pocket, man. Stay in the pocket. You're doing good. You're, you're almost in a zone-like state right now. And when you're in a zone state, you don't overthink it. Where you're, when you're on a run, you don't overthink it. When I wear a large jersey yesterday and it pays off, I wear a large jersey today and it pays off. Let's keep this going. Pick is in. Come on, Seattle. Come on, Seattle. Come on, Seattle. Come on, Seattle. Come on. Come on. What is it going to be? It's been saying pick is in for freaking 10 minutes. Freaking 10 minutes. Come on. <sighs> Come on. Come on, Johnny. You got this, man. All day, every day. They call you all day, every day, John. That's what they call you. It's not because you walk the streets. It's not because of that. Because all day, every day, you're killing drafts, dude. You're killing drafts. Carol's not, he's not running this no more. You're running this, dog. This is your show. Shaquem Griffith walking out onto the stage with the Seahawks selection, card in hand, looking swaggy as hell. Love it, love it, love it. Woo! All right, all right, he's about to announce it. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Yes. Yes. You better believe. Oh, I better have people believing in this house with the 72nd selection in the 2022 NFL drafts. The Seattle Seahawks general manager John Slider absolutely slay the dragon that is this NFL draft. Selecting Abraham Lucas, tackle, Washington State. You better believe it. Let's go. What? 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 Yes. 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 Fuck yeah. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Let's go. Come on, here we go. Abraham Lucas, Charles Cross. 
Oh, oh, it's a new day. It is a new era. Don't talk to me. Oh, Carol's here. Oh, Snyder's still here. What, what new can happen? What new can happen? I can tell you what new can happen. You yourself got yourself a goddamn offensive line is what you just got. You just got the two next book in tackles for the next 10 years. Congratulations. And you didn't even have to move around to get it done. What amazing value. Amazing value. Yes. My favorite pick of the draft. And goodness, this is saying something. This is saying something. My favorite pick after all of these that have been just home run after home run. Holy hell, yes. In case you can't tell, in case it isn't crystal mother effing clear to you right now, I love me some Abraham Lucas. I love me some Abraham Lucas. And you better too, and you will too. Don't right now, but after this live stream today, go watch my Seahawks scouting channel, because you know what? I just about, what was it, nine months ago, maybe it was nine months, nine months six months ago, did a breakdown on one Abraham Lucas for your Seattle Seahawks that they just selected. And I loved his film. It was so hard to pick apart almost anything in this guy's game. Almost anything in this guy's game. And you've got a tremendous pass protector. You've got a guy who has so many starts at the college level on that right side at Washington State. And yeah, same like with Charles Cross, he played in some of that air raid system of Mike Leach for the first couple of years, but not last year. Last year he had to run block. Last year he had to do some more traditional lineman things. And you know what? He did them real well. Real well. You can go watch, by the way, on my Seahawks scouting channel with that evaluation I did of Abraham Lucas. I did a cut up of his of his reps against one Kayvon Thibodeau. I also happen to include that on that, that breakdown. And uh, guess what? He did pretty good. He did pretty good against Kayvon Thibodeau. Folks, I've been asking for years. Why am I so happy? Why am I so hyped? I shouldn't have to tell you, but I'm going to do so anyway. I've been harping for years. Get the offensive line. Get that right first and foremost. I ain't talking about a quarterback. I ain't talking about Russell Wilson right now. I'm just talking about how you build a football team. And you do that with those tackles. You do that with those great interior guards. You want to pose your will? You want to be the big bad bully on the block? You want to make people fear you? You want an offensive line that can impose its will on anyone? This is how you do that. What a Beautiful step by our Seahawks in this draft. Best draft in years, and we still got a whole lot more picks left to go. Best draft in years. Lucas has got a huge floor. We can debate and go back and forth about where his ceiling exactly is at, but his floor is monstrous. Monstrous. Ready day one. Ready day one. Curran has no chance. I know you got people in the chat. Love yourself some Curran. He has no shot. No shot against Abraham. No shot. It, it's one of the more amazing things I saw with Abraham too and how he will work within this zone system is because he is six foot seven. But again, too, he also tested really well. Really well at the combine. Again, another reason why I'm, I'm, I'm absolutely shocked, shocked that he fell this far in this draft because it's not like you have any place you can pick at. He's got the, he's 6'6", 320. He almost has 35-inch long arms, folks. Lucas has 35-inch long arms. And even though he was 6'6", six six, he ran a 4'4 shuttle, which is short area explosion, short area quickness at the combine. And oh, that just happened to be the best of any of the tackles in this draft, of any of the offensive linemen in this draft, at six foot six, at six foot six. Good luck picking his game apart. Good luck. Maybe you could hit level of competition. Maybe you can say, well, he's not at the SEC, but that's all you got. That's all you got. Mm -hmm.